Malfurion versus Garrosh. Victory or death. I must protect ah. the wild. Settling the oh, okay. Do I keep a keeper? I don't think so. <laughs> Greetings. This looks quite good. My greeting. So it's wild growth into either shredder or keeper, depending on what he plays. Into probably Harrison Jones at some point. I can clear this with a war axe, but I don't want to use Harrison Jones on it. Uh, I could swipe it. No, the, like the problem. Hmm. Nah. Uh, okay. Well played. My thanks to you. Seems a little bit on tilt. But that's why I kept the keeper in my opening hand. So. Speak to me. Whirlwind. Uh, so he probably sets up for a battle rage. Ah, uh, that's annoying. Inner rage? Oh. So I could force to deny him a good battle rage. I could swipe hero power. He has an inner age, so he might use it on a patron next turn. So hmm. Well, I guess I just play Thorson. Doesn't look like he has a has an easy way to deal with it right now. Of course, he wins via card advantage, but. You might not even have a battle rage right now. But then he only has three mana. Um, second War Axe or an Execute. It's basically what's he, what he. Well, inner. Uh, okay. Both battle rage is gone. Card full of hands and probably want to execute. Wow, if he plays Thor's the next turn, I have a serious problem. Yeah, of course. <laughs> I guess I just play lore. Okay, I play the Harrison Jones, probably. It's pretty much given. Maybe Ooze. Could play Harrison, Innovate, Keeper, get rid of this too. Can play Ooze, Keeper. I can play Ooze, Coin Boom, actually. Might be better. Uh, innervate boom. You'll get a probably like super high amount of armor, but the rest doesn't seem too great. Hard, hard, seriously. 
Actually, it might have been better to play the... No. That's an execute... Nah. Oh. Might have been better to play this before the ooze, actually. Just to potentially clear this board. And if he wants to execute, he has the trigger anyways. He's yeah. almost out of cards already. Ah, uh, that's tough. So next turn I can play these two. I don't even have to swipe anymore. That's good. Well, you have to protect the war zone. At least you have to try. Um, let's see what we hit. Ah, eh, well, it doesn't make too much of a difference, I guess. Actually, that might even be better, depending on his hand, because he could play war zone patron this turn. That belongs in a museum. Pretty much need force. Uh, no, savage raw. That's nine. I need ten. Actually, that's ten. Okay. Well, this works. I think. Uh, nine. Fifteen. Anti-weapon tech succeeded. Ooh, the chain caller. Uh, that's an easy mulligan. I just realized that I didn't. Whoops! Should have probably waited a second. That I didn't check if. Eloise was streaming right now. Or if it was her. <sighs> Innovate Shade means nothing for a serious amount of turns. It's not even that good against everything that he might play, but... On the other hand, if he plays something like an Acolyte, I would probably want to get rid of it anyways. Let's, let, let's just do it. And this time I'm... Yeah, I definitely hit this. I'm not missing one damage again. Like one being one of lethal is so frustrating sometimes. Okay, so here's the thing. If I hit this, I'm vulnerable to execute Fiery War Axe, Coin Death Spite. That's a lot. I might be able to swipe this the next turn. There's no need to innovate this, I think. Let the pain speak to me. I don't want to deny him both cards. Okay, so I play Keeper, Innervate Wrath, hit this. 
And this dies to Death Spite and Execute. If he has Execute Death Spite, he has the coin still. Then my board is clear and I don't have any more minions left. I guess I'll have to wait until this is so big that I actually threaten lethal with combo very soon. Um, if I just play this, this sets up for a perfect battle rage, so I kind of have to clear this afterwards. Yeah. I must save but, which also denies me dealing with the patron with this wrath. This hand is pretty awkward. Well, maybe I'm lucky and he... No. Yeah, well... <laughs> I hope that he doesn't run Brawl. That's what I wanted to say. <laughs> um, Swipe a good turn here. Don't think so. It still sets me up for very good Battle Rages, but... This will just uh, give him two armor. I, I still can't clear this in a good way. And setting this up to grow even further puts at least up some pressure. And also, I want to have a somewhat okay way to deal with Coin Emperor. Hmm. <laughs> so this is 8, it's 10, and Coin Emperor. Let's see. That's 8, that's 10, plus 2, it's 12. 12 plus 8, it's 20. <laughs> I'm very close to to kill him actually. That's a little bit gross. But I'm not quite there yet. Especially because I'll have to Oh if I got a wild growth. Twenty-four. Okay, doesn't matter. Um I have to kill Emperor. It's just a question of tools. I could finally reveal all these and like trade, swipe. No. Yes. Trade. Something like that. Time waits for no one. Kind of don't want to use to lose my savage raw thingies here though. <sighs> I guess I ran out of time. And I have to sacrifice this just because of Warzone patron stuff. Might have been better to just trade and clear his board though. This was a pretty silly turn. But I just need to pick up a force with this one. The question is if I will survive until turn 9. Yeah, pretty good. I probably should have just... Yeah. <laughs> That's 12 next turn. 12 plus 6, 18. Of course. And I also don't have a swipe to deal with this now. So to trade those two in... It's 8, 10, 11 next turn. Can simply kill this this way. Kind of committed to the, this path, but the last turn was clearly a mistake. I should have just cleared his bar, denied him a battle rage, and uh, like even if he executes, there's still a lot of value from these because he cleared his board. Uh, I would have had the swipe to somehow deal with this now, but yeah, if he has, he definitely has a whirlwind now, which means four armor, two more patrons. If I n if I start clearing now, this is going out of control basically. But I think I don't have a choice anymore. Yeah, I messed this up pretty heavily actually. Whatever. 
At least I'm not losing that much. <laughs> Charge forward. My blade be thirsty. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Got a lot of good discounted cards from the Emperor there. Two, four, six, eight, nine. If he has another whirlwind effect, I'm dead anyways. I went way, way, way too greedy with my shades. There's no way, yeah. That's exactly the result of not clearing the board at the turn where I should have cleared. There's no way I can return. I can see. Well played. Lira. Rogue. Watch your back. I must protect the wild. <laughs> well, huh? Okay, this makes it a little bit better. Um. I can kill one of his three drops and I don't know. I'll have to see what then. I'm not sure if I like going first, even with wild growth against Rogue. Okay, I guess we're just ramping up more. Okay, this is pretty sick though. He'll have five mana? Four mana? Four mana, five mana when I c can play Ancient of Lore. But until then, I'll need something. There's not much in the deck, there's actually just Dr. Boom and Savage Raw and Force of Nature, which I wouldn't, probably wouldn't play here. So any other card would be basically fine. Yep, I take it. Clearing this always costs four. Unless I ref. I don't want to leave it up, that's for sure. Can easily clear the lore with Eviscerate and. Yeah, maybe that's just enough and plays around Flurry also. Guess I just cycle this. Could play second wrath shade. Ah, uh, well, kind of forces him to have flurry, but deadly poison flurry no doesn't make it different for him. Uh, deadly poison flurry is three mana. Okay, fine. Then he can't do much else, and I get the initiative on the board with my first play again. Now I just trade and play lore, I guess. That's a good play for the next turn. Or I could swipe Shredder. But this is a very good flurry then. I also want to draw deeper into my deck, obviously. Nope. 
Ten cards. That's scary. Like, Deadly Poison Flurry still clears, but he at least has to take five damage this way. Okay, good thing that I kept the swipe, I guess. I am ready to learn. Okay. Ah, Emperor, Emperor, Emperor. Swipe, hero power, three mana. I'm asking myself if it would be bad to play Emperor, clear this thing. And even if he clears my board next turn with huge prep flurry stuff, then I can still swipe it, hero power, and use Shredder and another Shredder. Five? No, not not exactly that, but almost. Uh, actually, this works too. Makes it easier for him, kinda, but... At least I have a discount in hand. Not sure. What did he do last turn? Hmm. Yeah, I'm a little bit stuck brain wise right now. At least I can play like these three things next turn. Ah, this guy's toast. This is even better because it's not that. Vulnerable against the flurry. Still don't have any combo cards. And no boom. And no second lore. And no weapon destruction. That's weird. Like six, seven. Yeah. Half of these draws are very good. The other ones are Lothab, which is pretty good too. Innovate's not so much. I don't want to flood the board that much. At least if I don't have Lothab. I see you. Okay, got one of the good cards. Five, eight, ten. Looks pretty decent. This, if the leftover survives, it's 8 plus attack value plus 2, so like 14 damage. Oh, it's not enough. Yeah, there, there goes the flurry. Finally. Mm. Maybe I should have charged with this thing the turn before. Well, this way he took th four more damage. Huh. Hmm. Probably would have been almost the same result. Maybe I took would have taken more damage if he has something like a backstab. Oh, this is great. This is so awesome. Fourteen. That's. Okay, let's say, oof, yeah, yeah, that's my big
I mean, even if just one minion survives, like, let's say this, it's still four, six, eight, so I'm pretty close to lethal anyways. And it should be hard for him to kill both of these. I actually can't imagine much. Um, most of his big minions are gone, Azure Drake and Lothab. So, I don't know, maybe he plays... Like, if he plays Healed Bot, Earthen, then I just charge him dead. So, I don't know. Like, six mana deadly poison? There's not much that can save him, actually. I can't, I can't even think of something, so... Let's see. Seven mana sap. It's still... Seven mana sap is still, like... Six plus six, it's twelve, so... Oh, yeah. Well played. Well played. 